Okay, so we've had a mishap. So we're going to jack this thing up in the front, take out the cotter pin and the washer, and have a look at this wheel. Okay, there's our wheel, our tire size. Just using a scissors jack here in the front. Quickly now, let's pull out this cotter pin and washer and take this off. Uh, oh, there we go. It's right by the Carlisle. The Ian Carlisle. So what happened to this perfectly good tire? Well, the driver told me they had a little run-in with a box. And we looked at the damage and the bolt that unfortunately is sticking out from this box. I think we have our answer. So what I have for this purpose are a couple of rounded off screwdrivers that I'm going to use to uh, work this tire off the rim. Okay, so we're using both screwdrivers here, kind of playing a little game of leapfrog, inch and a half, two inches at a time. Meanwhile, maintaining our earlier gains, making sure it doesn't slip back. Here's the hard part, getting this final part off the bead here, getting from the inside. And uh, to improve my chances, I'm going to put a little um, dish soap on there. I'm also heating it up. I've got it sitting, I've got it sitting in the sun to help. I'm also going to hit this with a blow dryer, high setting. I've got this soaked up now. So I still have to use our screwdriver to get it started. And the second one. And this is a wrestling match. These That wasn't too bad. I think the heat helped out. Okay, we've got it warmed up a little bit. And also soaked it again. All right, let's put some soapy water in here, on here. And on the tire, on the inside of the bead. It's going to be easier to do this with a rag, I think. And then on the bead as well. I've got it sitting up on a couple of blocks. We're just taking it a little bit at a time. Kind of a grunt job. There it is. All the way on. Just 
14 psi. We don't need a ton of air pressure here. Let's see if we can get it to go. Wow, it looks like it's seated right up. There it is, 14. Okay, it's all on there, seated, mounted, and ready to go. Back in business. Thanks for watching.